E aí, brothers? Hoje eu tô trazendo para vocês tá, uma novidade aqui que um colaborador aqui do Discord liberou pra gente. Ele fez uma tradução do Xenoblas Blade 2, tá? Com todas as DLC e no update, como vocês estão vendo, 2.1.0. Tá bom, galera? Então, espero que vocês gostem, tá? Da tradução. Eu vou deixar o link do Discord ali na descrição. Então, vocês têm que entrar no Discord, tá bom? Vou ser bem sucinto. Vocês vão entrar no Discord. Vão seguir a regra 13 para estar tá liberando ali a aba da tradução do XB Traduções. Tá bom, galera? Eu espero que vocês gostem. Essa tradução foi feita em cima do, da tradução do Mafra. E foi disponibilizado aí para vocês aí. Graças ao colaborador ali do Discord, tá bom? Entre lá caso tiver alguma dúvida, algum problema aí com a tradução, tá? Vai vir ali junto com a tradução, quando vocês baixarem, um textinho, um TXT explicando onde que vocês têm que colocar para estar tá funcionando, tá bom? Eu vou ficando por aqui, só lembrando que o link do Discord estará na descrição do vídeo, Forte abraço a todos e agora a gente vai para o gameplay, tá bom?
We really do need to buy ourselves a new depth probe. The ping was off by 150 peds to the east. That's not gonna fly. And what about the treasure, Rex? Was it in line with your expectations? It seemed pretty solid. Didn't even have to reinforce it too much. Even with the labor costs, we should be able to turn a decent profit. Honestly, it takes you two days to run the structural analysis. Yet somehow you can gauge the profits in an instant. Don't go raining on my parade, Gramps. You know, I'm in the salvaging trade for the cash. A little business sense goes a long way. All right. Whoa. I didn't expect that. You've been living in this thing this time. Rips. No worries, Gramps. I think we know what's for lunch. Okay, time to take you down. Yeah! An entire horizon of white, a sea of clouds, and at its heart, the world tree, piercing the heavens. This, this is the world we call home, all rest. Story goes that when the world was young, everyone in all rest lived on the tree, together with our divine father, the architect. According to the tales, it was a bountiful land, and the people there held the power to command even the heavens themselves. They called that paradise Elysium. But then, one day, we were cast out. Nobody knows why. Perhaps we angered our creator, or perhaps it was something else entirely. All we know is we were forced to leave Elysium to live here in all rest where it turns out life was pretty hard but when it seemed like we would surely die out the architect took pity on us sending his servants the titans to save us the few of us who survived settled on the titans and we've lived in harmony with them ever since but now, those titans are beginning to die out. Uh, oh, the brazier does my weary old bones much good. You want me to move it, Gramps? No, that's quite all right. Leave it right there. Uh, right up. Not another one. Been happening a lot lately. Mm, more so than before. 
I wonder if anyone was living there. It seems not. And if there had been, they would have all left by now. Makes sense. Hey, Gramps. Do you think Fonset Village will be gone too one day? It would not be today or tomorrow, but one day, yes, it will fall. And you too? That's how it goes with us Titans. There's no way around it. Eventually, there'll be nowhere left to live. Sadly. So, you Titans were born up there. Is that right? So they say, for what it's worth. Mind you, I was born here on all rest. As for my ancestors, who could say where they were born? Can it really exist, this Elysium, and the Creator who said to live there? A land of plenty atop the world tree. If such a place did exist, perhaps we could all live in peace, with no need for fighting. Sure would be great for everyone, even folks in Fonset. If the Divine Architect can see us now, I wonder what he thinks. Back to making money. I think this hall should be enough for today. Oi, Gramps! Care for a little swim to the Argentum Trade Guild? You're planning on selling it now? It's getting toward my bedtime. Don't play the lazy old man with me. There's plenty of sunshine left. Kids these days. No respect, I swear. if it isn't Rex. How's business? Going all right, else I wouldn't be here. Fair point. So, which one am I unloading? We can leave that until I'm done negotiating. Shouldn't be too long. Well, morning is 15 gold per half day. I'll have you a gold after I sell the stuff. All right, later. Hey, hold on. You know I can't do credit. <sighs> Does it every time? No one, I'm afraid. Thank yours. Awesome. This thing's huge, and it's not even a Titan ship.